Michael Worth here, thethirstymuse.com. Got a great beer from Bells, stick around. This particular beer, the uh, 30th anniversary Imperial Stout, uh, was released in 2015, September, and uh, I only was able to get two of them, and I wanted to drink one fresh in 2015, eight months ago actually, and uh, yeah, I took down some notes, and basically it wasn't boozy, it was a very clean beer, it was good fresh. And I intended on letting this cellar for probably uh, somewhere in the neighborhood of a year, possibly two years, at least 18 months really is what I was kind of looking at. But as with all Bell's beer, I don't seem to be able to store it very long <laughs> or keep it on my shelves. In, in fact, I have literally drank all of my Hop Slam every single time when I want to do a, a photo session and get some of that stuff put together and even do an article maybe for the blog or, or whatever. They never seem to make it. I can't hang on to them long enough to do that. Uh, I'm just, I'm dying to drink them. Bell's makes excellent beer. In fact, with this being the 30th anniversary, I have something I want to talk about. Larry Bell uh, started the company and uh, in 1985, I've, I've heard some, some talk about 1983 and stuff like that, but uh, obviously with this being the 30th anniversary, it must be 1985. Now, to put that in perspective, uh, Rocky IV came out 1985, for all of you old farts out there like me. Um, Back to the Future, I don't know which one. There's too many of those. Anyway, um, yeah, we're talking like Dukes of Hazard on television and Dallas. It's a delicious beer. It really is. It's 11% alcohol by volume. Mine was actually made on August 28th, 2015, and it's got a letter C at the end of it, meaning it, it can be cellared. Uh, they, they do A, B, and C, I think it is. There might be even a, another one, but um, C means that you can cellar it. For the photography geeks, I, again, like the last video I showed, uh, pulled everything into Capture One Pro 9. That's how I do all my raw editing of the images. I'll send it out to Photoshop, do some tweaking, uh, pixel moving, whatever. And I may run a final TIFF image through Adobe Camera Raw just to boost a couple little sliders here and there to give me a little bit of clarity, a little bit of sharpness that, that's good for print or, or web, whatever it is I plan to do with it. But, you know, obviously you can find out more about Bell's Brewery uh, online at bellsbeer.com but uh, this this particular beer I, I wish you could smell it it's a great beer if you can still find this beer go out and find it uh, grab some of it if you can find this beer go out and find it if you can find this beer or if you can bribe a friend into letting you have it let him, tell, him, tell him it tastes horrible and he wouldn't like it he likes IPAs or something, you know. Either way, get a hold of some of this beer. Um, you won't regret it. Cellar it if you can. If you can hang on to it for a while, do it. I don't, I can't do it. I, I you know, at any rate, I'm just rambling. Go drink this beer. Find it. Drink it. That's all I got. Hope you like the photos I share on here. I'll put some stuff in the in the bottom down here, maybe. You know, I don't know. I ain't into it tonight, really. I'm just not. <laughs> I want to go enjoy his beer. I don't want to see her making videos. So, with that, cheers. See ya.